all right guys so i'm um, making another video right now on my this let's just say this is like a part two to uh, the last video um so just real quick um i've already made <laughs> a part two but it was it was in the dark and yeah you know how that goes with video footage you can barely see anything um so right now i've already tuned the car it's already been 50 miles as you can see it's 130 so it's past the 50 miles the i did i recorded it and it was just it was just too dark it was it was boring and i just didn't like the way it looked yeah so right now we're gonna go do highway pulls a little bit of highway pulls not too crazy my settings right now um i at first i just had it at stage three and that's it just with some throttle blips at stock 50 50 uh, halfway uh but i've turned the blips up all the way to the max i was super super nervous i'm still am uh, of drag race mode and uh right now just I, yesterday i bit the bullet and actually turned it on and tried it out and wow the difference it's 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 not that huge from stage three to, to to drag race mode but it is a huge difference from stock drag race mode if y'all don't know what i'm talking about um when uh, drag race mode removes every safety measure that uh that the car has to protect itself from wearing itself too fast so it says it's a four times it wears the engine the transmission the clutches and everything by four times i at first i was very skeptical i didn't want it but at the same time i was thinking uh maybe maybe they're talking about cars that are pushing a insane amount of power with insane amount of torque which my car right now is just stage two uh just just catalyst downpipes um intake and some other stuff um and so you know i'm barely pushing 300 i think wheel i don't i don't think i'm i'm pushing over 300 wheels to be honest with these m55s yeah let's get on the freeway um oh and one thing guys when you when you tune your car to axhp make sure you go to your mhd and, ch and change your transmission uh tune to back to uh because i there's multiple settings there's manual or xhp auto there's alpina flash or just a normal automatic um and so i had to choose mine i don't it didn't do a real big difference uh what it did do at first at first it felt kind of weird because it, my car was in third gear and drive for some reason like right now it was in third gear and it was like really weird i couldn't like give it gas but then after a while, it adapted to itself a little bit with the tune, and I just drove it like 20 miles, and it's much better now. So, uh, yeah, I don't got a head camera or nothing, so we're going to have to do this because I left my SD card inside, and I completely forgot it. But let me turn off DTC. We're not going to go too fast. That's fifth gear. You can see as fast as it dropped. This is the maxed out uh, throttle blips. And there's the upshifts. So right now, obviously, it's half thing, but all right, if I was to drop it one more. And then when I floor it, you'll feel a huge jolt. And this is drag race mode right now. So, all right, quick, let me downshift. The downshifts are so nice. Look at this. Nice and fast. All right, well, let's go. Super, oh my God, dude. <laughs> Downshifts are insane too, Jesus. But as you can see, look how fast the thing just drops back down to. Uh, let me downshift one more. So it is very, very, very quick on uh, on shifts, and I think that's gonna finish trying to race me in a three three point seven out gap that thing. But but look, this is like this is like quarter throttle. Super, super, super smooth. And the guys, before, if y'all have BMWs with the six, six uh, speed auto, auto, y'all know what I'm talking about. When you shift up gears, it's like a huge uh, push in the front. It's like you lose all power for a little bit, like, for like a second, and then you gain it all again. Um, with this tune, you remove that completely, or you, for stage three, you lose it comp uh, almost like 80% of it. Uh, on drag race mode, you lose it immediately, like completely, the full thing. Um, and it just you just get a huge uh, jolt in the back. It's like a huge, uh, huge kick in the back. Um, and it doesn't feel too good, to be honest with you. It doesn't feel like, you know, but it feels like it's doing something. It feels like it's actually, like, extremely quick. Because my mom's, she has an X335i, so that's the same engine as mine. Um, and she has the dual-clutch 7-speed uh, in her car. And this thing feels almost exactly the same as fast. Or if not, just a bit slower. But to be honest, I'll say, I'll, I'm not, I'm not going to say slower. 
to be honest, they're both fast, but uh, I tuned my mom's to a sport transmission, so my mom's is just a little bit faster, so, um, but yeah, from stock 7 speed to this, geez, they're, they're both like similar, the downshifts even. Holy cow. Holy cow. Holy cow. <laughs> you don't get that boom, boom, boom. All right now is boom, 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 boom. No torque, no torque reduction at all. And the torque reduction, the reason it has it is just so you don't feel that big hit in the back. And BMW, uh, BMW turns it up uh, to be less aggressive for comfort. Because obviously these are not M3s. These are not sports cars. These are just luxury cars. That's what they made them for. I feel at least a second or two faster than before. And it's just, you just catch speed. Like you just catch speed very, very easily and very, very fast. Insanely fast. What is this GLE trying to do it on? But um, you just catch speed very, very fast and very, very smooth. Before, this car used to catch speed, go to 80 smooth. But now, oh my God, it just it just like keeps pulling, going, 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 going. There's no stop. There's no BS in the middle, nothing. It just pulls and pulls and pulls and pulls. So let's go do this again. We're going to come over here and do it again. XHP also gives you a, uh, gives these tunes for the 7-speed dual clutch and the 8-speed eight, eight uh, ZF transmission on the new BMWs. And I can only imagine those transmissions. I, I've seen on forums for the 8-speed. They say it actually goes a little bit slower. It's actually slower. Um, and I'm, uh, I can, uh, maybe? I'm, I, don't, I don't know. I've never driven an 8-speed. They told me that they're extremely fast. But uh, on 7 speed, they say, yeah, you get a little bit of a, a, a boost, a little bit of speed, but um, it's not as crazy as the 6 speed uh, XHP Stage 3, which I could, you know, understand because those things are already extremely quick. Look, as soon as I put in sport mode, look at this, guys. It drops to fourth gear from 6 to fourth. One more drop. Real fast. Yeah, you can feel that. Is that a G80 M3? Oh my God, hold on, this is a G80 M3, guys. I just saw that G80, but it turned uh, left, even though it would gap the living crap out of me, but. Um, yeah, guys, so that's gonna be the end of the video. It's not a huge video. I just wanted to show you like a part two. This tune is very, um, I know a lot of people when, uh, a lot of people were like, is it really worth it, that money? Uh, is it really that fast? Personally, me, it doesn't make you. It doesn't make you super fast, guys. I think it will remove you like two to three seconds max off your like sixty to one thirty. I mean one hundred twenty or your like zero to sixty. But I don't think it's that quick. Um, it feels nice. It feels smooth. It feels clean. That's what if you th if you want that, then that's what this got. And you should do it. Why don't go ahead and do it? But other than that, really, it's just not a big. It's not a. It's not crazy. But I would do it because the reason I did it is because I hate the torque. Each time you shift up, you hit, you hit this like like very big stop, like a very um, sudden stop, and it's like a very slow transmission. So it like you switch gears and it's like slows down a little bit, and then that's because of the torque reduction that I got, um, which this is beautiful because this removes. So if you want just cleaner, crisper, faster, a little bit faster shifts, do it. Um, this is very similar to the DCT. My mom's obviously you can see my mom's right there. You can see my mom's right there. She has the X three thirty five I. And uh, that thing has a DCT, and oh my god, thing! Brum, brum. It has a little farts and stuff, and wow, that thing is just nice. And then when I drove, when I put the XCP out, I compared them, and wow, yeah, extremely, extremely similar. Uh, not the same, obviously, but extremely similar. Uh, but yeah, guys, it's gonna be in this video. Next video, guys, stay tuned. Um, I bought some sport uh, oil valve coolers and all type of uh, cooler oil stuff. Um, and y'all let me know what y'all want to see next. But yeah, yeah, y'all have a good one and I'll see y'all later.